over the next three years, teachers would see a direct increase of 27% to their salaries in this agreement. But that is not the totality of the increase. I will want to go through some aspects of the holistic agreement. In 2024, they will receive a 10% increase. In 2025, they will increase, they will see an 8% increase. And in 2026, they will see a 9% increase. Of course, these increases in these years has an adjustable clause. That is, if there is a high increase announced for the public service, the teachers will get the difference between what is in this agreement and that highest, higher number. Clothing allowance. There is an increase in clothing allowance of 88%. Of course, you know the duty-free concession. We have, would have announced increases and the condition that every teacher above a so certain level, once they're three years prior to retirement, will get the concession once they are at that level and would have served the years. So no teacher would leave the profession at that level without getting the concession. And I, I, I think uh, that that level was a, a senior master, senior mistress. Despite that, in this agreement, we have increased the number of concessions that will be granted by 50%. By 50%. In addition to the policy that all teachers who hold a substantive appointment as a senior master mistress or above within three years of retirement and have not received a previous duty-free concession are entitled to duty-free concession for one motor car up to 1,500 cc. In the case of hinterland and reverend teachers, they can be eligible for concessions uh, if, if they want uh, outside of the vehicles for outboard engines and ATVs. Scholarships. 100% increase in scholarship will be given to teachers annually. And of course, this is outside the fact that they are already receiving scholarship under the GOAL program and in some instances, University of Ghana. The re-employment after retirement. Teachers or teachers or educators hired after retirement will be paid at their last salary scale before retirement. Not at a low salary scale. You retire, you come back on a job, you'll be paid at the last salary scale before retirement. For SBAs, for the first time ever, teachers will be paid for marking and supervision of SBAs and the National Grades 5 and 6 mock exams. 